Hey again, this is Callum from Turbo's Chester, and today I'm sampling a bowl of Jermaine's Plum Cake. Uh, shout out to Sal1990 from the comment section for the suggestion. This tobacco is Virginia based and includes dark air cured tobacco and is topped with a flavouring made of wine and spices. So it's actually a slightly misleading name from what's actually in it. But there is there are elements of cakiness in the taste, but not necessarily what I've called this tobacco myself. Uh, when you first open the jar, the packet even, it's a very, very distinctive smell that hits you. Uh, it's very spicy, uh, there's a cakey element to it, like I said, but it makes me think almost like a Jamaica ginger cake. There's that sweet sort of stickiness, but then that element of sort of like uh, spicy ginger to it and a few other almost like clove-like spices as well. And some people report picking up a bit of aniseed on it as well. Uh, the spiciness definitely comes through in the taste quite a lot actually, uh, especially for the first few puffs, it's really, really spicy. And that's where the clove and the aniseed comes in and it is really, really quite potent for the first few puffs. And you're sitting, I'm finding myself standing there going, why is this called cake, like plum cake? It's really, really weird. But then as the bowl goes on, the sweet cakiness kind of, uh, starts to appear somewhere around like the halfway point. But what I get is, uh, it's almost like cake batter, almost. It's a really, really unusual taste. And then this fruitiness comes in. Uh, it, there is certainly sort of a plummy element to it as well. But then I almost get something a little bit citrusy sometimes as well, but there is definitely a nice fruity, cakey taste to it as well. Uh, the spice is still there throughout, but by the time you're getting towards the end of the bowl, it's really, really died down and just sits just underneath it and just combines with that nice sweet cake taste that's in there. Uh, it's an unusual blend, uh, but I definitely recommend giving it a try. Um, might not be what you're quite expecting, it might not be like quite a lot of other tobaccos you've got, but there, it's a very complex, interesting blend that certainly gives you something to think about while you're puffing and would be very good for a nice bit of relaxation. Uh, the taste's quite powerful, but the nicotine's not too strong, so it's a nice balance there as well. So if you do want to try it, it's available as always at turmos.co.uk. If you do try it, Hope you like it, let us know what you think, and until uh, if you like these videos, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more. Until next time, thanks for watching, and I'll see you soon. Cheers.